One of the most eminent learning institutions of the country, the Tapar Institute for Engineering and Technology is an abode of learning. A place where a seedling is nurtured to lead and contribute to humankind. The vision of Tapar Institute of Engineering and Technology is to be recognized as a leader committed to excellence in higher education, research and innovation that meets the aspirations of the global community. A name synonymous with a rich legacy of 63 years, Tapar Institute has set forth phenomenal milestones in the field of engineering. Be it India's largest dam, the F1 cars, or potato tubers for the packaged foods industry, the institution's marvels have not only won accolades, but have also contributed immensely to society. The Bakran Nangal Dam, for example, was designed in this very institution. So this institution has given India uh, many great alumni, many great uh, uh, engineering marvels. I basically love mechanical engineering, so that's why I've been associated with Urja from my first year and I've been this is the second vehicle that we produce right now. First they advertise what we have made in the college so that others also get interested in our work and... Team Urja is about, we are working for the technology of the future. What is Team Fateh? Team Fateh is basically a foreigner student team. You all must have heard about Formula 1. So it is a student version of Formula 1 series. We participate in competitions all over the world. The competition of foreigner students are held in UK, Germany, USA, Australia, India. Back in 2008, we started from foreigner student UK. And we, that was our first car. And in the very first year, we won the Toyota Best Endeavor Award in that year. Well, if you look at a specifically civil engineering student, it's, it's very lively in the sense that, you know, the career starts, you know, it's the start of a career when they join the first year here. And uh, in the very beginning itself, they are basically introduced to the core courses in general. But subsequently, they are introduced to all major civil engineering subjects. And a very important component of their career growth or, or their career path here is a very important uh, thing which we do here for our students. It's called the project semester, uh, wherein we send our students to the industry to do a project there. outcome-based education, we have lots of many things to do. Like in our curricula, we introduce design projects, we introduce experiential learning, we introduce cash on projects, which forms the basis for a student. Workshops and labs are integral to the Engineering Institute. But Thapar Institute goes a step ahead to introduce different exchange programs and teacher training workshops to offer international exposure to its students and faculty. If you want to become world class, there are only two ways you can do. What does industry do? Industry collaborates with the top uh, you know, partners around the world. And how do we do this? We thought one way we could do this is to uh, you know, tie up with a top international university uh, in the globe and uh, then learn from them very quickly and then implement some of those methodologies in teaching and learning and research and infrastructure uh, in our programs. So one such relationship that we developed for the very first time was with Trinity College Dublin. 
So in undergraduate, we admit students basically through the national level entrance test that is JE mains examination. And uh, we admit students in post-graduation through either uh, gate examination or our own entrance test examination. With a fit to 1920 session, admissions will be made on the basis of JE mains as well as on the basis of uh, 10 plus 2 marks. Thapar Institute did not keep itself limited to the periphery of Patiala. In the Derabasi campus of Chandigarh is the LM Thapar School of Management, which has stood testimony to this. The entire campus is exclusively dedicated to management studies and is consistently grooming the leaders of tomorrow. Before coming here, uh, I did not had I did not have any uh, management experience. I had no work ex, so I came here like a blank slate. I was very much you know uh, focused that I would be you know going for the finance. But when I studied subjects like marketing, so I fell in love with such, such subjects, and then I you know realized that you know I'm more kind of a marketing kind of person and not finance. Then it broadened my horizon, and so that I realized that where I where I fit right in my career. So it is equipping not only them with the knowledge or the skills but a mindset where once they join the corporate sector, they are able to solve the problems and that also with a sustainable and a social entrepreneurial mindset. As I was telling, you know, there are about 40 to 50 clubs uh, on campus uh, which uh, are under the ages of the Dean of Student Affairs Office uh, and that actually helps them uh, into their career path in the big way because that develops their personality. We have uh, a technical come cultural festival which we organize as an inter-institution festival uh, called Saturnalia. The Thapar Institute of Engineering and Technology combines experience and new age implementation. The placement, liaison and training cells help in realizing this objective. There are the organizations which are regularly visiting our institute for the last 10 to 15 years. I can name them DE Shaw, Microsoft, Google India, uh, Tata Motors, Maruti Ryuk, Informatica Corporation. We conduct a placement readiness test, that's a PRT. The career expert at the center would sit with him or her and devise an action plan for the candidate. The Center of Relevance and Excellence at TIET is involved in aided research activities for top MNCs. We are producing potato tubers and giving it to them. Thereafter, three further generations of seed growth are taken care of by PepsiCo itself. You know, it's everyone's dream to represent their country and luckily I got this opportunity this past year when I was selected for the under-20 ice hockey team of India. I just won uh, one a gold medal in uh, double crafts national shooting championship that was held in Jaipur. Life at Tiet's hostels is one of bonding, enthusiasm and vivacity. Tiet's state-of-the-art infrastructure and secure campus not only makes boarding life hassle-free, but also creates opportunities for students to become independent and confident individuals. In terms of the accommodation that this hostel provides in particular, it's a very new uh, infrastructure. They do study fantastically well, they do get placed very well, but also they get a lot of opportunity to excel in their fields of interest as well, which is what holistic growth is all about. Great Place to Study proudly features the Thapar Institute of Engineering and Technology as the Great Indian Institute 2019.